Lamar Jackson this, Lamar Jackson can't do that, Lamar Jackson, bla- yada, 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 yada. And I'm watching going, wait a second here. Hold the phone, people. Hold the phone. Lamar Jackson, are you kidding me? That's the best player in the country and it ain't close. What are we doing? Stop it, Stosh. No, 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 no. So guess what we're going to do? We're going to bet on ourselves if we're Lamar Jackson. Can you imagine sitting in a room? I just want you to think about this. You're sitting in a room. You're your own agent. So you, you don't have to share. All right? You don't have to give me any money. Okay. And they offer you 200 and some million. Right? They offer you 230 million. And you turn it down. Now, a lot of you are going to say, well, you know, he's worth more than that. He's betting on himself. Yeah, great. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about turning down to play football. He not solving the nation's problems. He not doing anything other than taking a ball and trying to get it 10 yards at a time down the field while entertaining us. And you turn down, let's just say for the sake of argument, $200 million. Think about that. That's how I look at the world that we live in. That's how I go about the business of thinking about professional athletes. Man, you're sitting there turning down $200 million. I remember when I signed a contract to be the head coach at West Virginia, and I read the contract. It said $500,000 a year for five years. And I said, look, you got to add two years to it with the incremental bonuses. And I couldn't stop laughing. Like, I'm teaching big guys in shorts to put a ball through a hoop, and you're going to pay me that much? Man, I got a dad who's a school teacher, a mom who's a school teacher, an uncle who worked in the mill every day, cousins that are uncles and security guards. That's real stuff. But Lamar Jackson said, out of heck with it. I don't care. $200 million, let's go. Good for Don't mess with him, because he told you all Friday. He said Friday. Friday's tomorrow. You don't have a contract, you don't, well, you're not negotiating during the season, and I ain't mad at Lamar. You know me, that's my man. I have an irrational respect slash love for that guy. Never met him, love watching him play. Every time I see him play, he plays great. 